Yeah, it's Sunday, the 22nd of uh, September, and uh, it's about 80 degrees here in Maine, and we're on a logging road, it's about 2 o'clock, and we're not going to see another day like this. I might, if I don't, I don't know if I'm going to survive the winter with my poor health. You know, I'll be surprised if I'm here next year. And even if I'm living independently, I might be in a nursing home or someplace or God knows where. Um, but anyway, I had a good 16 years here. Uh, my 17 year old cat was sleeping under the truck tire and turns out I ran over her and didn't find her till about three or four days later. She was 17. She'd been to the vet a dozen times. She'd had all kinds of operations. I kept her well. Her 16-year-old son is still surviving. He's still with me and I adopt. But I, I think that my pets are about over because I don't know if I, you know, I may not be living independently much anymore. So I was very sad about that. I She came to my house 16 years ago and she has three beautiful kitties, and uh, so I have one kitten left, he's 16, and yesterday I was throwing a soda bottle at him, an empty bottle, to get him to get out of the driveway, because they're old and they just think they can stand there, and not just them, I had a cat, there was a cat on my street, who was, uh, wouldn't get out of the way, and I'm honking, I mean, some somebody's cat, so, oh boy, you know, it felt so bad to see my cat, but she died instantly, and she was 17, had a pretty good life, and she, I loved her. Loved my cat, my mother cat. Brings back, I got 17, well, 16 years of memory since 2003 with her and her three kittens. Her kittens, when they were too big to, to sleep on her back, all three of them, they used to attach themselves to my socks and my feet. And sleep there at night. <laughs> I'd have a kitten dug into my socks. It didn't hurt me because, you know, the claws were in the socks and they'd be sleeping on the end, grabbed onto the end of my foot. <laughs> Beautiful. You know, we all have, those of us who love pets have wonderful pet memories, but people and pets don't last forever. <laughs> no, they don't. There's a little bug. Oh, some fly. There's a few little bugs, but and uh, you can see it is a truly beautiful day out here. This road goes for miles and miles, logging road. And I can't even see in, oh there, I think I'm getting a reflection in the viewfinder. But, uh, and you can see they're still doing, they always do logging up here, so. Now I'm gonna take a walk. So Marty, if you're listening, baby, you can see, by the way, you can see some of the leaves are changing already. It's September 22nd, up by the Canadian border here, and uh, leaves start turning. Well, I'm 69. I've seen plenty of leaves. I've seen just about all I'm going to need to see, so. To my friend Marty, hope you're having a nice day, and, well, God bless. Bye-bye.